Hello YouTube, it's Detroit Borg and I'm back with another demonstration of the Apple iPad camera connection kit. This time I've been trying to connect iPods and iPhones using the USB adapter from the camera connection kit. And in front of you you can see my entire iPod collection, iPod and iPhone collection. Here we have the 5th generation and 6th generation, iPhone 2G, iPhone 3G, and iPhone 3GS, iPod mini, iPod Nano 1st gen, 3rd gen, 4th gen, and 5th gen, the iPod Touch 1st gen, iPod Touch 2nd gen, and all of the shuffles. Besides the iPhones, none of the iPods except for one work. Instead of showing you what happens to each iPod when you try connecting it to the USB adapter since they basically behave all the same, let's go ahead and check out what happens with the 5th generation iPod Classic. Now, as you can see, the iPod says do not disconnect. Uh, this is similar behavior when you connect it to a computer, but I'm not doing that. I'm connecting it to the iPad. And the iPad should give me a message right now. Here it is. The iPod is telling me the attached USB device is not supported. So that's generally the story when you connect all iPods. Now, there is one that differs. So let's take a look at that one. So of all of these iPods, which one actually works? Well, if you guessed the 5th generation Nano, you're right. And that's because the 5th generation Nano has a built-in camera. So anything recorded on the iPod Nano can be imported to your iPad. So let's go ahead and make that connection. So we see connected, eject before disconnecting, and automatically on the iPod, the photo album app has launched. And all of these thumbnails are actually videos. So we can import all or import selected. In this case, I'm just going to import one. I did a test earlier. So when I select it, I get a blue check mark. If I click import, I can import the selected. And the blue check mark becomes green. So let's go ahead to events. Go to my last import. And let's click play. So there you go. Not only can you import videos and photos from your iPhones, you can also import them from your fifth generation Nano. So once again, that's Detroit Borg with a quick demonstration of connecting iPods to your camera connection kit on your iPad. Please rate and subscribe. Thanks for watching.